Good afternoon. My name is Zora Bender from Mount Olive Missionary Baptist Church, where Reverend Charles K. Bender is my pastor. And we're here for our Bible study. And today we're going to get started with a little prayer. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we come today in the name of Jesus, asking you to strengthen us. Strengthen me, Lord, to do your will, Lord, and be a good example for others. Pray that I make this lesson plain so you can understand exactly what I'm trying to get the students to understand, Lord, that you are the way, the truth, and the life. So in the name of Jesus, I pray, amen. So we're going to Philippians 4.13, and that's a scripture we all know. Philippians 4.13 says, I can do all things through Christ which strengtheneth me. And it's very personal. You saying, I can. And then strengthen is me. Those are personal pronouns. And we need to say that over and over again and really believe that you're able to do practically anything God asks you to do. So for a subject or a title this morning, just do it. I know you've heard that before. Just do it. So some of the slogans from businesses I'm going to mention and I want you to think about it. Can you find these slogans anywhere else other than the business slogans, okay? Or have you heard them before? The first one is, and see if you can tell me who it is. Oh, what a feeling. That's from Toyota. Bounty Tile says, the quicker picker upper. All state insurance says, you're in good hands. Almond Joy says, sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. And then the United Negro College Fund has a slogan that says, the mind is a terrible thing to waste. And even Hallmark went to the thing and said, when you care enough to send the very best. And then someone said, you got the right one, baby. Yes, that's Pepsi my favorite drink and then the last one that i'm going to mention is the nike slogan just do it now think about these slogans can you find these slogans anywhere else i heard them anywhere else because i'm going to the bible now to acts 5 29 that's acts 5 verse 29 that says then peter and the other apostles answered and said we ought to to obey God rather than men. So please don't listen to Burger King because you cannot have it your way. Or don't even listen to Kit Kat who says, give me a break. So instead of listening to these slogans from the businesses, spending a lot of time singing them, going to these places, spending your money. Let's listen to some of the things that God have said. And I'm going right back up here. Did God ever tell you he's a quick picker-upper? Did he ever tell you that you're in good hands? Did he ever tell you that he cared enough to send the very best? Did he ever tell you you got the right one? And then he tells us a lot of things like Nike, just do it. And all the thing we have to do is just do what he say. So instead of spending all that time and money on these businesses, let's spend that same time and money and energy on God, what God has said. Because John 14, 6 tell us that he said, I am the way, the truth, and the light. And there's a song that says, I'm your rock, I'm your sword and shield. Also, John 9, 5 tells us, I'm the light of the world. So only thing we got to do is just believe and just do it. Because God is all you need. Thank you.